what's the key against Florida? Uh, to stop the run. You know, we're able to stop the run, force them to play, pass the ball. Like they're not, they don't normally do is pass the ball. They mostly have success running, and we stop them, force them to pass, and create opportunities for uh, to get the ball back for the offense. What's it like being in the BCS bowl game, preparing to get ready, playing the sugar now? Oh, it's great. You know, it's a lot of activities we've been going on, have going on. You know, just being in this uh, atmosphere. You know, it's exciting. You know, preparing to get ready for the game. It's just something. It's like a bigger stage. You guys have had some fun. Is the fun kind of in? Now? I mean, you know, I know coaches, the curfew's changing and all that. I mean, is the fun kind of in now? Yeah, it's winding down. Um, but we we really enjoyed ourselves from the time we had. Um, whether we keep on, you know, for the next few days, you know, do some more events, you know, we're just gonna and we just like we just gonna have fun. Like, we have fun most of the days. What? When you look at the defense, which you had the first two years pretty strong this year, the expectations were building. You guys are not as, like Coach Bedford said, you're ranked 25th. You're not as far off as you've been, but the perception is that you haven't played as well on defense. Did you all hear that, those whispers and people talking about that? Um, I post to us all the time. Uh, we never play as, we, never, we haven't been playing on as we pass, as the past two years. Um, but that's supposed to be our focus, you know, to get back to where we used to be. We always bring that question, why are we, why are we playing, why this, and why that? You know, we're just going, we looking at every aspect of the defense, you know, from the D-line to the safeties. And, you know, we just question ourselves, why we're not doing this? So, so we go on each practice, you know, we work on our techniques and get back to our fundamentals. We love talking to Coach Bedford because, you know, he's a character in like some while. What do you like around you? Oh, man, Coach Bedford is wild. <laughs> but he's a great coach, man. You know, it gets you energized, gets you going. You know, even though he gets down your throat, you know, he, he motivates you at the same time. How are you wild? Oh, uh, just, you know, he's yelling, you know. He, he acts, he acts uh, crazy sometimes, too, as, in a funny way. In terms of, uh, I asked a couple of guys about this yesterday and today. How sweet are the bowls this year when you get to the BCS bowls? Oh, they're very nice. Uh, uh, compared to the other bowls, you know, they're very, very nice. Uh, the wash is nice. Uh, the jumpsuit is nice. Uh, the events we're going to, uh, all those, uh, everything is nice. What was the best gift you got last year? Uh, let's see. The, I guess the belt bowl. Um, the shop is free. Okay. Yeah, that was nice. With the what? The shop is free. We had at the belt store. Oh, shopping spree. Oh, okay, gotcha. So what about this year? What's the best, the best thing you got? Uh, besides the little gift suite, basically I just say the trip here. Would you have to, is, you said gift suite, is it something that you get to go in and you get to pick something? Yes. So what would you have to pick from? Oh, yeah, uh, headphones, there's speakers, there's TVs, uh, there's a big kind of couch, uh, there was a watch, there was cameras, there was a lot of things. What everybody want? What was the one thing everybody want? Uh, i say it was either TVs or headphones. There's some guys that got the sofa, the mm -hmm. little big couch. <laughs> cool, thanks, man. You watch the Kentucky game last night? Oh, yeah, I caught some in the end. <laughs> Did y'all get together somewhere and watch it? Or? Uh, we just all uh, separate because we was like tired. Everybody's in their rooms. Do you remember when Vance dropped the first get on the train? Yes. And how it kind of blew up? What do you guys remember? Because there was YouTube videos and T-shirts. I mean, what do you guys remember from what he said? Uh, first of all, we laughed at it because you know there's a lot of people who created like little funny things about it. Yeah. But you know, it opened our eyes. You know that that we're in a great situation. And that we need all support. And uh, having everybody get on the train, you know, supporting us all the way through is going to create, uh, you know, like excitement.